Locals and tourists enjoyed unseasonably warm weather at Madrid's Retiro Park on Friday in the middle of Spain's winter. As people walked shirtless, rode at the park's lake, and sat at outdoor cafes, some were worried that the spring-like temperature could mean that the summer season could become unbearable. I'm really scared, because if now, during December, we are wearing short sleeves, then in a few years, during summer, we wouldn't be able to live here. I'm really thinking whether we are going to be able to live here. It's climate change. It's the biggest sign of climate change. If before, you needed to wear a coat during January, and now you can wear short sleeves and shorts, it's a bad sign. It's a spring-summer day. We don't need all the clothes we brought to Madrid, and we left our coats. It's going to be a great day. I wake up thinking about the weather, as I need to choose my clothes, and I don't know what to wear. If I should take the coat or just a thin jacket will do. By midday on Friday, the temperature in the capital had reached 23 degrees Celsius, or 73 degrees Fahrenheit. The meteorology service said it expected temperatures to reach 28 degrees Celsius, or 82 degrees Fahrenheit, in parts of Andalusia, in southern Spain, with many other parts of the country climbing to 20 degrees Celsius, which is up to 10 degrees Celsius above normal levels for the time of the year in some places. Scientists have linked scorching temperatures and dry and windy conditions in many parts of the world, including southern Europe, to climate change. Last year was the second warmest on record in Spain, with consecutive heat waves causing droughts and wildfires.